Miriam and this is Miriam's Way. So if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do that. But today this is going to be a nursing video. So if it's not, if you're not interested in, in any of my nursing stuff, you can click off this video. If this stuff do not pertain to you, you can um, politely leave. But I, I welcome everyone and I'm going to talk about this, um, this issue about um, the coronavirus and about all the nursing classes that are going online and you know normally we go in class we do clinicals and there's a lot of stress for people because they have kids at home and they um they can't study they can't focus me myself um i got used to taking my kids to the daycare but i did at a point of time um study at home so I know what to do so anyway so I'm just here to give you guys some tips on how to see the nursing school with it being online right now because some of the schools are not allowing students to go back to school um our school haven't really made decision yet if we're going to go back or not or at least go in take our tests so I'm just going to tell you guys some of the things that I've been doing okay so like today um I normally um, since I have two small babies, I normally read or study when they're sleeping. So right now they're sleeping. So um, I just finished reading one of my um, chapters for school. Like everybody know that nursing school, you have so many chapters, so many things coming up back to back to back. And right now, since everything is online, they've been getting a lot of work and a lot of um, things like that. So I'll just say, just make a schedule um, of what you're going to do. Because I know it's not easy to not to like be at home you're gonna get distracted with the tv so i'll say um build yourself a, a office or a desk where you can go somewhere and study and have that time for um for just doing your homework or whatever or studying because nursing school is very uh it requires a lot of discipline from you and um if you're not used to this this is the time to like search videos to like find ways to to cope with the stress and anxiety of nursing school plus this virus that is a pandemic uh, around the world so um another thing you can do is it's time someone while you're studying like one of your classmates so if you're used to being around people you can like facetime them while you're studying and you guys can like study together that way talk about um you guys do your own reading or whatever you how you do it and then call each other and then um discuss the pro discuss what you guys want to talk about so you can um shoot i'm saying um, a lot <laughs> sorry about that Find ways to do activities with your children the same while you're studying. So when they are awake and I have to study, I'll get them some scratch paper and get them to write their name while I'm reading. I can at least get like 20 minutes in, um, 20, 30 minutes while they're doing their activities. And also if you have like a backyard, you can take some of your books out there and read it. Like you can just find ways to, to study with kids or if you don't have kids if you have pets or whatever the case may be if you have a husband like find ways to make time um because we can't go anywhere we, everything is closed the libraries are closing the starbucks are closing the bookstores are closing so it's nowhere to go but at home or at in your yard so do you have to be creative just think outside of the box and because the school is going to keep going on so so either you're going to get over this and pass are you gonna be stumped and be thinking like you know freaking out when you can just like this video and i'm telling you guys what to do okay and also um another thing that i do um when it's time for my kids to go to sleep uh, i bring my laptop because you know guys like if y'all watch my previous video i have an ebook so i um I'll read to them my chapters. Like first I'll read them their, their stories for bed, but if they're still like leaning on to go to sleep, I'll um I'll read my chapters and they'll feel so bored re listening to me read that they will just go to sleep. So that's another thing that you could do is like um read and if you have time if you like have to wash the dishes or have to clean up, play your lecture, you know, while you're doing this, while you're cleaning up, while you're washing dishes play your lecture if you have headphones play your lecture while you 
while you um, folding the clothes for your kids. Uh, play a lecture while you um, cook it. Like I, I find ways to put in time to study because I think I study like most of the day, <laughs> most of the day, but I still take care of my house. I still have to cook lunch, breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, like I still have to do things for my husband. So it's not impossible. And um, like like I said, just find an environment, find a space that you can um, set up your, your, your desk. Like I have two, I have my desk in my room and I have, I used to, I turned the living room into my desk, the under uh, dining room also into my study area too. Cause if like somebody come into the room and they're being too loud, too noisy, I'll just move. Or if I want to um, change the, the vibe of my studying, I'll move it to a different area to give me more motivation to study. Um, also like, um, if you don't have like, you feeling like, oh, this is just too much. Just get up and leave from where you are and go somewhere else and then come back um, with a fresh mindset and then maybe then you'll be able to study. But you can't like use this time to forget about your studying because online classes, it requires a lot of discipline. And I'm used to online classes. So I'm here to tell you guys with nursing, it requires a lot of discipline from you guys. You have to set yourself on the schedule. You have to stay you have to stick to that schedule because the, the work is still going to pile up. The work is still going to come and the test is still going to be there. So you just have to find ways to succeed. And I, I hope you guys, I wish you guys the best in this time. I pray for everyone's safety. Um, I pray everyone pass um, their classes, nursing classes. Um, I'm sorry about this um, situation. It's nothing that we could do. We can just live the um, live through it and help everybody get through it and hope that everybody pass and become future nurses to to get out there and be motivated to help these uh, people in this time. And if you are working right now, thank you so much for taking care of everyone. And if you're not working, you know, thank I just thank everyone for just you know helping and doing your part and. Um, yeah that's all i got to say so i hope you guys like this video and please give a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel Miriam's way and like i said toodles